What's up everybody? Um, today I am going to do a kind of an overview or review on my E-Revo VXL um, brushless edition. Uh, sorry I haven't made a video in a while because uh, I decided I wanted to get a computer game and ended up completely messing my whole laptop up and that's my uh, basically my laptop is what I use every day to do my schoolwork or uh, basically edit my, all my YouTube videos so I decided I was gonna d uh, get a game and end up messing up the whole thing so well guys I'm back I uh, completely fixed my whole laptop after two days of trying to figure it out so let's get started on my review on my brushless e-revo um, first off you have your Traxxas power cell battery I mean as you can see this thing is small compared to my hand as you can tell it's real small uh, I like this battery a lot. I plan on running dual batteries. You can run dual batteries in this baby, so it's awesome. So yeah, that's the battery. Um, this is the Traxxas transmitter. Um, this is the regular transmitter, as you guys can see it. Yeah, pretty cool. Uh, I'm trying to gotta hurry up, guys. My camera battery's about to die because I don't know how to freaking charge it. Well, I do, but. I just, uh, <laughs> I never do, so, this is the Traxxas, I mean, yeah, Traxxas E-Revo Brushless Edition, the Mini E-Revo, um, as you can see, it's got the spoiler, really nice, uh, real good suspension, so let's take the body off real quick, so you guys can see it, and, uh, unlike most cars, the pins are super easy to pop off, I mean, it's real easy, it doesn't take a lot of force just to get them off. Uh, hold on guys, one second. Alright, I took the body off. There's the body, as you guys know. E-Revo VXL brushless. Uh, let me move that out of the way, guys. And uh, here is the basic chassis design of it. Uh, dual suspension in the front. I like the way it's hooked up right here instead of like having a... Uh, a spring come down here and then a spring come down here is just right here in the middle really nice um, you have it in the back also really nice and uh, here is the brushless motor along with the ESC and servo uh, from what I'm looking at under here um, there's a servo right there I'm guessing you could probably switch the servo maybe run dual servos I don't know I haven't uh, did any research on that yet but anyway, that is their E-Revo. It's very, very awesome. This thing is super fast out of the box with just this battery. Just one battery is super quick, but I can run dual batteries because as you can see right here, guys, um, there's little tabs that you press right here, and the, it comes down like this, and you just basically stick your battery down in there, and then you plug it in right here. Um, I have both battery compartments, one here, and turn it on to the other side. And you basically have another battery compartment right here, so you can run dual batteries. I just got to buy the 799 plug that has uh, basically three, three of these ends on it, and then it plugs into this battery, and plugs into the other battery plus this, so it runs on dual batteries. But um, yeah, that's the Mini E Revo. This baby is really, really awesome super fast out of the box uh, if I get time not tonight because it's real late it's like uh, I don't know what time it is but um, I'm gonna make a probably a, a video of the tire ballooning uh, I guess I hope you guys know what that is it's when the tires like get bigger when you give a gas but anyway it has all-wheel drive um, runs on a brushless motor kit which I paid three out of the hobby sh out of Hobby Town USA, the complete total of this thing was um, I think three three fifty total because I got a uh, my parents bought me a Team Losi rock crawling course little thing for my Xmont rock crawlers so that's why. But uh, when I went into the hobby store, I was gonna I was originally gonna just go in there to see what I wanted, but it, out of all the big trucks and everything, this is what caught my eye right here. Um, they had a regular E Revo with just a like a regular um, I forgot what size motor um, I think it's like five five forty or something like that like in my mad truck 
just a regular motor, uh, ESC and all that crap, was two, I want to say two, 200 or 220, something like that. This thing was 299 for the brushless, which is way worth it, guys. I highly recommend you getting something like this. It's really durable. I done flipped it one time in the snow. Uh, electronics are waterproof, the servo, everything's waterproof on it. But um, this thing is awesome. I love this truck. It's like my favorite truck right now. But yeah, so um, please stay tuned. Maybe I'll have a video of it running down my street. Maybe an onboard camera. I don't know. My camera's kind of big, so I don't think I can mount. Well, maybe I could put fit it like right here or something. I don't know. Um, post comments. Let me know, guys. Sorry again about the long wait for another video. I decided I was going to get a dang computer game and completely mess up my computer. Um, so yeah, thank you guys for watching this video. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Thanks.